Those are sounds of young boys and girls. Well, if you have watched the video, those are pupils from City View Academy here in Juba. And now they are joining us live in the studio. Good morning. Uh, thank you so much for making up time to come to our studio here in Radio Miraya. I'm sure we have Mabiel Daniel Deng, who is a teacher, and Margaret Anuel Adar, Emmanuel Bot Manyok, and Agnes Deng. Welcome to the program. We sing, we act dramas, mostly how often suffer. We act how children suffer. Like there is a song about the suffering of children in all the states. It is all there. We also sing about the suffering of children, the suffering of soldiers. So a good-hearted person, we have those uh, human beings that have good hearts, will understand and will try by possible means to help those groups. So if they help, they will have changed the nation and they will, this, the messages will be heard in the, mes in the songs. People like even you, if you have that good heart, you also handle how to take care of the children, the girls, and the poor children. There are some many orphans suffering and no one is supporting them. If our leaders will support them, then we'll we will have hopes because we shall be happy when orphans are in the school with us. Actually, the changes which I want to see in South Sudan is that one of the changes is that the government should build enough resources for the for the orphans and children and at large the soldiers. So good security should be there. These are the changes that we want. Good security, good hospitals, good schools and development of the country. The way how children here and the suffering, it is not good. So I joined that if there's a way that our leaders could help us, say so that these orphans here will get education, good hospitals, and good security. But today, today the land has turned to be flaggy, the land of heroes and freedom fighters. Where is the promise? Oh, motherland, where is the promise? We hope that this song will touch the hearts of our leaders so that we see change being fostered in the country. Well, you're listening to the Miraya Breakfast Show and this is where the nation's biggest conversations begin. Stay tuned as we'll have more updates coming your way. Where is the promise? One on one FM. 
about the nation, across the nation. Radio Miraya. We got an emotional moment when this teacher was breaking down the things for us. And, and we hope that this does not just end at being a song. And, and we hope that this song can, can reach out to the people concerned, to the leaders concerned, that they need to think about it. So many people have hope in this country. I'm captivated by the song. I mean, these are, the sound is so passionate. And you know how you sing a message and it's felt? Right. That's what I feel when I hear the song. Yes. So this begs the question, um, Abiyah Deng, who is the uh, uh, head teacher for music, dance and drama, what is the background? We just had to have them at Radio Miraya. We just had to have them here so that everyone in South Sudan is able to experience what these kids are trying to portray. I mean, our job is to amplify any message for peace, any call for peace, and together, hopefully one day, we will achieve and realize that peace. This is a story, and this is a story.